If you look closely in this video, you'll see right here a spider has built its web out in the middle of a walkway. Now this walkway is used daily by us. So this spider web was built last night and it travels a long distance. If you can get an idea how long the distance was, it starts up here in the branches of this tree and traverses along the driveway way out over here. And that means the spider had to build this nest overnight he had to climb on top of this cart and then on top of the tree and then back over to those trees over there. That's a distance of about 15 feet. But it did so overnight and there you can see the spider working his web and it's been successful. I'll try and get a better, better view of him. And there he is actually working on a, on a bug that he caught last night. But it's an amazing feat to think that that spider could build that overnight and be successful in capturing some bugs. And you can see I'm working on that bug right there, right now. Getting his meal before the day comes. You know, all the pedestrians in the, in the nursery who arrive and break up his nest. At our nursery here on Route 313, we have a lot of these spiders that show up and they do a lot of work in eating bugs. And as you can see, we have a lot of nursery stocks, so they have a lot of places and points from which to build their nests. A lot of times these nests are taken, taken apart during the day by birds, such as the finches building their webs, their nests with the webs. And there's a spider nest right there. And there's a couple more right up in here. You can just see the hole in there where he goes into, that one. But it's amazing. We'll, we'll see the birds out here all day long gathering up the webbing for their nests. So give us a call if you need any nursery stock. We're here on Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. It's Highland Hill Farm. Thank you. At our nursery here on Route 313, we have a lot of these spiders that show up. And they do a lot of work in eating bugs. And as you can see, we have a lot of nursery stocks, so they have a lot of places and points from which to build their nests. A lot of times these nests are taken, taken apart during the day by birds, such as the finches building their webs, their nests with the webs. And there's a spider nest right there. And there's a couple more right up in here. You can just see the hole in there where he goes into, that one. But it's amazing. We'll, we'll see the birds out here all day long gathering up the webbing for their nests. So give us a call if you need any nursery stock. We're here on Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. It's Highland Hill Farm. Thank you. At Highland Hill Farm, we have a lot of different kinds of trees for you. We have both deciduous and evergreen. Some of the spruces that we have are like Colorado Bruce spruce, Norway spruce, white spruce, Serbian, black hill spruce, black spruce. We also have some firs such as Fraser, Balsam, Douglas, and Concolor. Most of these are in seedling or transplants. We do have larger trees such as white pine, Norway spruce. We also sell a whole range of arborvitas in many different sizes from transplants up to large trees. The trees that we sell are both bare root and bald and burlap and potted. We have thousands of them that we grow. We also have southwestern white pine and we are noted for our green giant arborvitas and Leland cypresses. We also have hemlocks up to 10 to 12 foot high along with redwoods. We can also supply you with some bald cypress, larch, eastern red cedar, in the way of shrubs, we have arrowwood viburnums, bayberry, blackhall viburnums, a whole range of viburnums, dogwoods, red, twig, silky dogwoods, elderberries. We also have forsythia, common lilacs, Japanese lilacs, peking lilacs. We also have nanaberry, ninebark, and things such as Russian olive, which some people think are is invasive. 
but we do sell a wide re range of trees and shrubs, including winterberry holly. So give us a call at 215-651-8329 as we do deliver and we deliver and plant.